What's up guys, welcome to another Bogey Wogey Boys video. Today we got a quick one, a simple one, but one that has been highly requested by uh, a few of you in the comments. We're gonna do a what's in the bag for the 2024 season. This is pretty much what me and Frank will be playing all year. Maybe a couple minor changes will happen in there, but who knows. Uh, let's get right into it. All right, I guess we'll start with the wedges, guys. Um, this is probably the only thing that will change for me this year. Everything else I kind of am stuck with. But um, I have three Titleist wedges. I have a 60. This is an SM8. Um, S-grind, 10 degrees of bounce. I also have a 50 and a 54. So it's kind of a big gap from 54 to 60, but I feel like I prefer that over 58 because, you know, you know I'm Gucci Garrett with the flop shots. What? This one's just normal steel, like chrome finish. And then these two are brush steel. Nice. Brush steel's kind of nice because like you oh, don't get as much sun glare. My bad, I didn't mean to cut you off. What, what shaft do you have on those? It is uh, just the wedge flex, the ones that come with the, just the stock wedge gold? flex sap, uh, shafts. Yeah, we're on irons now. Um, grab a four iron here. A dirty four iron. Here we go. I have the Mizuno Pro 221s. Um, I don't plan on changing these. Unless we get sponsored. Hey, Titleist, TaylorMade, Mizuno, hey. hit us up. Everybody. Hey, hey. The first blade that actually feels kind of forgiving for me, That's honestly. That's crazy. Show them the butter knife real quick. I don't know if you guys can tell. Yeah, we'll show a quick. That, he said it's forgiving. It does feel pretty forgiving as far as blades go, but I would say if I did make a change on irons, I would probably play like a cavity like a slightly more forgiving four or five, four and five iron. But and if you if you would choose, what would they be? <sighs> Whoever the one, the, sponsors us. The ones I have. Yeah, it actually would be probably the 223s. <laughs> Moving on to the hybrid. Probably my favorite club in the bag. I have a TSI 3 hybrid. I like this hybrid a ton because most hybrids that I've hit go super high, like too high. And this one seems to be able to launch low can hit stingers with it hit it high work it really well it's got like sort of a smaller smaller look Head. to it i like it a lot which i like too I which, like what shaft do you have on that oh it just the hazardous smoke 6.5 nice the low spin shaft i don't know um i didn't really get fitted for the shaft on this one but it works perfectly so three wood a 915f this is the oldest club in my bag i'm telling you the only thing i don't like is this little slit it gets grass in there but other than that Really good three wood. Uh, tend to stick with three woods, I think. Shaft? Longer than normal. The shaft is uh, Diamana, 80 gram. No, oh, it's Diana. Uh, extra stiff, Diana. Diana. This girl Diana made this. <laughs> That's not even a good bit. <laughs> okay, let's go to the driver though. My second favorite club probably. TSI three driver. I have it in nine degrees. So good, it does not spin, I swear. It does, just doesn't spin when I hit Shaft. it. I have a Ventus TR Blue 6 Extra Stiff. Extra? Um, You're that guy? Yeah. I'm What's swinging, the ball speed? I'm swinging fairly fast. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, this driver, 10 out of 10 recommend. I don't know if the TSR is any better, but TSI, good, Titleist, Titleist. What you kind of bag you rocking with? Oh, we got the Sunday Golf Bag. We still got the putter too, but. Oh, I'm sorry. We got the Sunday Golf Bag, Sunday Golf Towels. Shout out to them if you want to buy any of their stuff. They have the best bags, best towels, best hats. Uh, code BWB, BWB15 in the description. Um, and then the putter. Frank knows I switch putters a lot, but I have the Scotty Cameron Phantom 5.5, and I feel like I can't miss my line with this, but I also have a Scotty Cameron Super Select New Point New Port 2.5 and my speed is better with that. So I always switch back and forth. I'm missing my line with the other one. Switch to this one. Um, if I'm messing up my speed, I'll switch to the other one. But should have brought the other one. I like them both. I mean, this is the one I play most, wouldn't you say? I like I like that one better. I feel like you make I feel more like I make with more putts with this one. 34 inch Scotty Cameron stock shaft, and I use this grip. I like this little grip. pistol grip, right? Yeah. It's nice. Balls that I use, whatever, usually like a Pro V1 or a TP5. Glove. Glove. You know I got to, you know I got to do them with the goat lane. You know how to double it. Boy, get the heck out of here, boy. <laughs> <laughs> and shoes. then the shoes are goat lane too. Always goat lane shoes, always goat lane glove. BWB 15 in the description. Let them, them know that we're, we're Literally looking. the best shoes. We're going to be doing a giveaway with them soon. Guys, we're going to send it over to Frank's bag, which is slightly worse than mine. Nah. He's a slightly oh, worse Oh, yeah. Let, let them know. They, they can choose what. Oh, yeah. In the comments, let us know really which nice, setup you like better. I think we both have really nice clubs. So Yeah. 
His wedges though. My wedges are His money. His wedges. Right. Let me at least make it kind of presentable, unlike you. No, you're good, bro. Bro, you had like a four, five, and an eight iron in one slot. Yeah, they're not gonna look at that. Yeah, but they're gonna judge you for it. Moving on to what I think is the better bag. I'll start off with my wedges. First, I have the uh, SM9s. Okay, I have them in a 46, 50, 54, and 60. I have them in the, I believe it's the S400 shaft. I took the sticker off because it was peeling. But cool thing about these, I got these in jet black. And then your boy made them raw himself. I'm, well, a, I'm a little DIY, uh, do it yourself type of guy, you know? So I okay. left them in overnight with uh, distilled vinegar and now they're, but also I have red grips on all my clubs. Guess who did that? Me. The, the irons, I have four through nine. Mizuno 223 uh, Pros, and um, I don't know if you guys saw, but there's uh, there's some lead tape on there. Shout out to Akshay Batia. He's the reason why I have uh, lead tape. So some of you don't know, when you add lead tape to the club, you know, you really mess with the CG. You move it around and stuff. And What's CG? Moment of inertia. <laughs> CG. Center of gravity. Center of gravity, there we go. Well, it's, it's center of gravity, moment of inertia, same thing. But anyway, you know, I kind of struggle to flight my uh, irons. So with this, you move the CGI more to the middle and the ball just goes a lot higher. Oh. But anyway, flight. same thing as Gary. I don't think, like, I love these irons so much. I don't think I'll ever get rid of them or change them unless, you know, we get a little sponsor, maybe. Next this weekend. video is just basically our, our just begging uh, for a sponsor. Yeah, a four iron through nine modus, I think. Yeah, um, they actually had to make custom shafts for myself. They put extra, extra stiff. Yeah, and they cut so. them by like seven inches. Oh, so all my clubs are <laughs> cut down six inches, guys. <laughs> my hybrid. Oh my god. She's old. She's old. She's a ping I twenty, uh, twenty degrees. You know, lead tape. Shout out Akshay. Uh, I got this when I first started golfing. It's a three hybrid, and I just I can't get rid of it. Like it's a go-to. I've tried, I've tried so hard replacing it. I've had other hybrids, and she just keeps finding her way back in my bag. She's a girl. She. What's her name? They're all girls. They're okay. All my, all my clubs are she's. Okay. But anyway, I love this club. I've, like I said, I've tried getting rid of it, and I just can't. I can't. Project X stiff shaft, I believe in this. Yeah, 6.0 stiff. So. Three wood, the newest addition to the bag that I will not be getting rid of. Yeah. Oh, shout out Malbin, by the way. Uh, Malbin, if you want to send us some stuff. Uh, I bought this, I fought this, I fought this, I bought this MSRP retail. Is MSRP and re retail the same thing? It's like the recommended price. Okay. Market anyway. recommended price. Yeah. Three wood, we got the Paradigm X, uh, 15 degrees. The shaft is hazardous silver gen... 60? It is 6.0 60 grams, yes. Anyways, I love this thing so much. I, I've always struggled to hit three woods because they're like so much thicker. Like they're not as thick as a driver, but to me I've always felt like hitting driver off the deck. And this one, I don't know if you can tell, but the profile is really slim. It's just like a longer or a fatter hybrid, if that makes sense. Yeah, it's like yeah. more slimmer. So that's what I really like about this uh, three wood. It's super slim, easy to hit off the tee and off the ground. So driver, um, I've had, I don't know, maybe six drivers in the past two years. Yeah, you change some things to all the time. Trying figure it out, but <clears throat> finally, it's not you. It's the driver. Yeah, yeah, it's it's always the driver's fault. But finally, same thing as Garrett. I have the TSI three. I a little bit of lead tape on there because you know, uh, <laughs> you know, same thing for the CG CGI moment of inertia. And yeah. I also have the weight on the heel because. I, I kind of struggle to turn it over sometimes, you know? Oh, he's she, a knowledgeable boy. You know? So with a little bit of lead tape, with the weight, you know, it makes it a little bit easier. But I really do love this driver. So much more consistent. Uh, I still slice one every now and then, but you know, when you're a good golfer like me, that you're you're going to hit some bad shots. But it's, it's <laughs> When you're a good shot. golfer, you're going to hit bad shots. <laughs> <laughs> it's the next shot that counts. Uh, shaft, shaft, I have hazardous. the Hazardous RDX Smoke. Uh, stiff uh, putter. So... Same thing as Garrett, because I like to copy him a lot. I have two putters that I alternate with. First, the blade. Shout out Malbin again. Full price, MSRP. Uh, go ahead and zoom in on this. I mean, just the Is that a finest, Miura? The finest, 
finest putter. So nice. It looks good. It feels good. It might be fake, but I don't <laughs> want to go get it uh, authenticated because that's going to break my heart because I spent a lot of money on it. But uh, if you've seen our TikToks before, the Miura. Uh, I love this thing. It was very expensive. I got a pistol grip on it. Uh, Ventus TR Silver. Uh, with the blade. <laughs> Ventus TR Silver. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. The mallet. If you can't tell, I love head covers. Oh, another Dia de los Muertos. Well, it is. It is. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Don't, don't. So, other uh, putter that I use is a Betty uh, Inno Innovate. Betnardi? Innovate? In I don't know, but it's a Betnardi, the, the mallet. In Innovate. But anyway, this, this putter, dude, when this thing is hot. <sighs> okay, hey, calm down. Bruh. You know she's hot. <laughs> no, uh, you, you could probably really pistol good grip with it. lampkin. Uh, this one, uh, this one does not have the Ventus TR silver. It's just a regular Betanardi shaft. But this putter is money. So the opposite. My line is always really good with this putter. My speed is usually the one that's off. I usually hit this one kind of short. But when she's hot, it's over. She's hot. I have the full size Rider bag Sunday. Shout out Sunday. Um, for the balls, anything I find in the range, to be <laughs> honest, I always find really good Pro B ones, Chrome Softs, Vice Pro Plus, anything I can find on the range. Uh, range Finder, Voice Caddy. This is actually mine and Garrett's. We share it. It's a uh, touchscreen. Pretty sick. Shout out Voice Caddy. They sent us one of these a while ago. Love is Goat Lane. Shoes are Goat Lane. Look at those shoes. Um. Uh, Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Hopefully you guys really enjoyed this video. Make sure you comment down below whose bag do you like better. I think my bag is better than Garrett's, but Garrett thinks his bag is better than his. So mm. comment down below. Maybe you like a mixture of both. Uh, we got a lot of dope stuff coming out. Did I ever say like, comment, and subscribe? Uh, yeah, you did. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Click all the link in the descriptions. Yeah, you're good. I think that's it. Peace. Peace. Later, guys.